first time I attend Redarte actually, so I'm really excited. They do have this whimsical world that they live in, um, and that's where all these creations come from. It's like outsider art for fashion. Deconstruction, reconstruction, it's what fashion designers do. But you can trust Kate and Laura Malevi to put their own spin on that. The process makes them think of Frankenstein, and this season Rodate has made some very beautiful monsters. Deconstruct, reconstruct. It's a bit strange, but it all comes out to be really beautiful. When we started working on the collection, Laura and I had been driving around and we saw this huge, like, pile of insulation that somehow had like fallen out of a truck and I said to Laura I think like maybe for our next show we'll play with this idea of like a Gordon Mata Clark's art and this idea of a deconstructed house. I get an aura of science fiction out of it. Sci-fi like rock star. I mean, it was amazing. And that Edward Scissorhands leather jacket I thought was incredible. <laughs> the leather was either silk screened or hand marbled. All the fabrics were marbled by hand. We were saying towards the end of it was like driving us crazy because we didn't actually have a palette in front of us. It was all in our heads. And it's so fascinating to see them develop. It's so high concept, but it's designed by women, so it tends to be pretty instead of just avant-garde for the sake of avant-garde. I mean, I totally think it's sexy, but I think a lot of men would be intimidated by a woman who showed up in one of those outfits. And all the details that make you look at the clothes and the texture, the combination of texture, makes you want to approach this lady, no? It's more bang for your buck. And what did you just see? Um, a future explosion through the eyes of Kate and Laura for Redarte. There's a lot of charisma in saying, this is what we're doing, and here it is, and voila. And I think when you nail it the way that they did, then people will respond to it. We are lucky to be witnessing these girls in New York, out of New York, and I so look forward to seeing what they're going to do in the future. The next it thing that will be around forever, you know, House of Redarte.